la lune. A ballad by Edgar Allan Poe. The skies, they were ashen and sober. The leaves, they were crisped and sere. The leaves, they were withering and sere. It was night in the lonesome October of my most immemorial year. It was hard by the dim lake of Auburn in the misty mid-region of Weir. It was down by the dank tarn of Auburn in the ghoul-haunted woodland of Weir. Here once, through an alley titanic of Cyphus, I roamed with my soul. Of Cyphus with Psyche, my soul. These were days when my heart was volcanic as the scoriac rivers that roll, as the lavas that restlessly roll. Their sulfurous currents down Yannick, in the ultimate climes of the pole, they groan as they roll down Mount Yannick, in the realms of the boreal pole. Our talk had been serious and sober, but our thoughts they were palsied and seer. Ah, Memories were treacherous and seer, for we knew not the month was October, and we marked not the night of the year, all nights of all nights in the year. We noted not the dim lake of Arbor, though once we had journeyed down here. We remembered not the dank tarn of Arbor, nor the ghoul-haunted woodland of Weir, and now in the night was senescent and star dials pointed to morn, as the star dials hinted of morn at the end of our path, a liquescent and nebulous luster was born, out of which a miraculous crescent arose with a duplicate horn, Astarte's bediamond crescent distinct with its duplicate horn, and I said she is warmer than Diane. She rolls through an ether of sighs. She revels in a region of sighs. She has seen that the tears are not dry on these cheeks where the worm never dies. And as come past the stars of the lion to point us the path of the skies, to the Lathian peace of the skies, come up in despite of the lion to shine on us with her bright eyes, come up through the lair of the lion with love in her luminous eyes. But Psyche, uplifting her finger, said, Sadly, this star I mistrust her pallor, I strangely mistrust. Ah, hasten. Ah, let us not linger. Ah, fly, let us fly, for we must in terror, she spoke, letting sink her wings till they trailed in the dust in agony, sobbed, letting sink her plumes till they trailed in the dust, till they sorrowfully trailed in the dust. <laughs> 